Hello everyone. My name is V. I'm 14 years old, and this is the first time I've posted this video on this group. And I hope you like it. Let's begin. Your dream can become a reality if you refuse to quit. Be like a lion, never back down from the challenges you face. A lion never stops chasing it, race until it catches it. You never stop chasing your dream until you live it. Dream big and never let small minds convince you that your goal is out of reach. That may be out of reach for them, but you know better. Believe in yourself, and if you're on the ways of your goals and dreams, I suggest you move. <coughs> okay, so I've done my video about this topic speaking, and I want to introduce you to some structure and some new words that I found really useful for our speaking skill. And yes, that is. So we have these two words. The first one, dream, is a verb, and it means ước mơ, ước mơ một thứ gì đó. And the second one is a noun, một giấc mơ, and there are two pronunciated, dream, dream. For example, if you can dream it, you can do it, and the dream here is a verb. A more example, your dream is great. And this dream here is a noun. Can you see the difference between these two words? Yes, I hope you'll see it. So we'll go to the second one. A really great structure. There we have a really fantastic structure. Stop. Go with an ing verb. It means dừng làm một việc gì đó. For example, I'll never stop learning English. So, it's really easy, isn't it? And more example. I have to stop smoking right now. Just kidding. Finally, we have out of reach. It means ngoài tầm với. For example, being fluent in speaking English in a short time is out of reach for me. Nói tiếng Anh trôi chảy trong một thời gian ngắn là điều ngoài tầm với đối với mình. So, but I'll try my best to be fluent. Okay, that is my speaking video. If you like my video, please like and share for me and thereby I can get a prize in this competition. Thank you and I love you guys so much. I can hope I can see you in the next week. Goodbye.